And what's going on, y'all? We'll back at you again with another reaction. Um, we're about to get into some more Hunter x Hunter. Many of you know, last episode was the most emotional episode of the series so far. I'll give it top three as well. So far, the top three episodes have been in this arc, which is kind of insane. This arc has been absolutely amazing. It's been a fucking masterpiece, honestly. That's one of the best arcs that I've ever seen in any anime, TV show, or anything. That shit had like, great fights, it had like, great animation, great voice acting, great storytelling, great narration. Uh, the narration was honestly fucking top tier, bro. More animes need to do narr narration because it makes things so much clearer. You know, it doesn't make sense. It doesn't make sense when the fucking characters in the anime are, are you know, saying what their powers do out loud. My power will make you see things. Like, why would you even say that? You know what I'm saying? It doesn't make any sense. So narration makes a lot of fucking sense. More animes definitely need to do that. That's a good idea. You know, it's a great idea. So yeah, they put everything into perspective. It's like the, it's like a smarter viewer was telling me what the hell was going on. You know what I'm saying? So narration, great. Uh, and of course it had emotional stuff. It had character development, character regression and gone. It's just so many things. Obviously, uh, I'm going to I'm gonna get into more detail about everything in the Hunter x Hunter in my Hunter x Hunter review video that I will be doing when I finish Hunter x Hunter, which is going to be very soon. Um, also, I'm, I, I'm, um, today, today I'll, I'll, I will be making a Naruto review video uh, because I have finished OG Naruto, the original Naruto series, and that will be coming out later today. Um, that's going to be that's going to be a lot of fucking editing, though, so could, could be a little late of an upload, but you know, whatever. I'm, I'm, I'm trying it out and see if you guys like that kind of thing. Um, but yeah, it'll pretty much have the culmination of what I think about the whole series into one video. My favorites, my dislikes, everything. You know what I'm saying? So, watch out for that. And uh, yeah, so last episode, I mean, fuck man, we saw a fucking... The, the, the Beauty and the Beast. It was the plot of the Beauty and the Beast. We had this guy who was pretty much a fucking... used to be an asshole. Now he's a gentle king, and we had this girl who made him into that, really. This fragile, uh, blind, snot-nosed girl if, uh, who, can, you know, who can't make a coherent sentence, pretty much cries all the goddamn time, you know what I'm saying? Um, but she, Komugi, was able to make Medoem, you know, she was able to subdue him, you know what I'm saying? Not in a sexual way. I, I saw someone in the comments say, they ain't trying to fuck. It's not about fucking. First of all, man, this is, this, this is, this is, you could definitely sense their, their relationship, you know? It's about love, dude. It's about love. You know what I'm saying? I, 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 I'll go as far as to say that there was definitely some, uh, not romantic, like, love, like, kind of like, just, just bond love. You know what I mean? Like, there is, Meruema and Kumugi developed a strong-ass bond through playing the game of Boongi. You know what I'm saying? And that kind of love. Not the fucking type of love y'all fucking thinking about. Get your head out of the gutter. Goddamn. Um, anyway, yeah, amazing. I, I mean, it, did I, did I technically cry? No, I mean, I, I didn't shed a tear. My eyes got watery, and I made like the crying face and all that stuff. But I didn't, I, I, I didn't like, you know, I didn't shed a tear. So, um, but it got me watery, and that's saying a lot because I'm not a crier. I'm just not. I'm just not. You know what I mean? I'm pretty, uh, pretty strict, straightforward kind of guy. So I don't, I don't, I don't really cry on that type tip. But I, I kind of did, so. Um, and for like an uh, anime cartoon to have to have me do that, that's that's pretty intense. It's pretty crazy. So, amazing. The last couple episodes. Um, so now what? Now what? Now I have to know if Gon's still alive, right? And they also alluded to finding the successor for the chairman. So I guess those two things are left to do. There's about ten or so episodes left. And uh, yeah, man, I'm just excited to finish it off and see where it leaves me, you know what I'm saying? So, without further ado, make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button, and let's get into it. Hunter x Hunter episodes 136 and 137. <laughs> okay, so the... I mean, the Chimera ants that are left, they're all good Chimera ants, right? I mean, now they are. Fuck. Oh shit, fucking Bezef is still alive. We don't like Bezef though, right? <laughs> Why is he still alive? Oh, 
Damn, why do I feel like super bad for this one? Jesus. <laughs> I feel like her story is intense. Try not to die until you're dead. What a quote. <laughs> Are they ever going to at least allude to who Gyro is or was? They keep saying his name. It wasn't the king. That's confirmed, right? Because he didn't really respond to it. True, low key, Welfin. He was the one that said Kumugi to the king and kind of saved everyone's lives for a split second. That's true, Welfin did that. <laughs> he did do that. I'm not gonna take that away from him. Indeed. You know, if the, if the fucking. If the Chimera Ant girl um, sitting in the, in the passenger seat had a, had a. I guess a higher pitched voice, she, she'd be cuter. Her voice kind of annoys me. Oh, okay. That's where she used to live. And she's scared that they're going to reject her. Wow. Aww. <laughs> okay, that's, a, that's an expected reaction. So don't go too crazy. That's the... That's the mama, yeah. Wait, is that Reyna? <gasps> That's not Reyna. Oh my god, it is. Dude. She can talk. Oh, it's her. Dang, I thought I was done, man. <laughs> Ow, sorry. Dude, where's Colt at? We need to get Colt over here, bro. Have Colt meet up with them. They're definitely gonna know. They're gonna recognize him. Hell yeah. Well, this is just the most wholesome thing ever. Damn it! I thought the <laughs> I thought the emotional stuff was done, dude. I can't, I can't, I can't take it. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm good. Uh, Y'all ain't gonna see me. Y'all ain't gonna see me cry. Y'all ain't gonna see it. Well, it's nice to see the Chimera Ants, you know, all, all finding a home somewhere. On their next journey, on their next mission, perhaps. Their next stage of life. Oh, it's Bravado was there too? Oh, he was just trying to be a tough guy. I get it. He's trying to be a macho man. Oh, wow. That's so fucking awesome, dude. What? Oh, come on now. Are you serious? Oh my god, that's Kite. That's fucking Kite. That's Kite. Oh my god. Dude, what? They're like hitting me with all the fucking feelers right now. And I don't appreciate it. <laughs> Okay, so he's alive, but he's on a coma, bro. He's in a coma. He's done. He's done. Fucking gone, dude. Whew. 
Such a tragic story, man. Is there like a Nen healer or some shit? Like an ultimate Nen There's gotta be one. There's gotta be a fucking Tsunade of the show, right? A person that can just heal anything? Damn. The life support breathing. Yikes. That's true. Gon didn't ask for help. He didn't ask his best bud for help. There's not, there's not supposed to be pride blocking your best bud. Your best bud is your best bud. You know, they're with you to the end. and That does kind of hurt that Gon didn't... Gon actually kind of pushed Killua to the side, honestly. Like an asshole, so... I feel you, brother. You know, what? Oh, he's got the fucking murder eyes. Where is he going? He knows a way? Well, I wouldn't put it past him to not know a way. He's kind of like, you know, he's 12 years old, but he's been through some shit, so maybe he does. Damn. For the person to become the chairman, they need a 95 and up percentage vote? What the fuck? Is that what he just said? That is... I mean... Shit, fuck it. That's a big percentage. The Zodiacs? They're the hunter leaders? It's motherfucking Ging. He's one of the Zodiacs? Look at him, he looks all... <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Let me... Yo. Before we move on to the next episode, I gotta say... Why does Ging looks like look like he's been living his best life, bro? His hair's all messed up. He's going there with tattered clothes. He's been fucking just living, which is great. But also, like, bro, your son is in a coma right now. I want to <laughs> low key. I want to punch him in the goddamn face. But he's living his life, so whatever, right? <laughs> I'm trying to point that out there, real quick. Fucking Ging, dude. Alright, so these are the, uh, candidates? Oh, they all, they're all connected to a, uh, an animal. Ox, rabbit, snake, sheep, chicken, monkey, why is this? <laughs> Boar, dragon, Tiger. Dog. Horse. And the last one, rat. I wonder if their animal kind of says something about their personality. <clears throat> well, he looks the most professional. And he's the vice chairman? Hmm. <laughs> I kind of like this guy. He's bold. And he's obviously being purposely uh, politically correct. Okay, Snake, Jesus. <clears throat> oh. Okay. So this Pakistan guy is up to no good. I assume. I feel like he's constantly acting. <laughs> I don't know. This is one of those characters where I'm just like, is he a good guy or is he a bad guy? Oh, okay. Ging I'm actually surprised Ging said that. 
He seems uh, the kind of guy that just wants to chill, you know? Don't want to vote for either <laughs> Okay. Ging, why, why, why isn't Ging visiting Gon? <laughs> well, here's the thing. I want to vote, but I don't know enough about all of the contestants. Or okay, candidates, right? I'm definitely not voting for Ging. Because I don't like him, honestly. I understand he's like a super strong hunter and Gon's dad. But... I mean, just right now, the fact that he's not fucking visiting Gon is pissing me off, so he can go fuck off for all I care. <laughs> and as far as this Pakistan guy, I mean, I did like him until dude said he's, you know, hunters have been hit disappearing under his watch, which is definitely sus. <laughs> but other than that, you know, he's, he's a bold guy, kind of like that. And I don't know anything about the rest of them to make a decision, so I guess we're just going to see. His name is actually Bean? Couldn't they? <laughs> they could have done better. <laughs> Maybe it's like a it's like an ironic thing. <laughs> also, I'm not gonna lie to you, chickens looking kind of good back there. You feel me? She's looking like she belongs in the Cirque du Soleil or some shit, man. Oh, he's having them sign? That's... interesting. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. Ging just wants to fucking have fun, bro. God, I'd li I do like that about him. I mean, live your life, definitely. But at some point, you gotta think about your shine. Damn. Well, he just fucking... He literally predicted everything that was gonna happen. Is that his net ability? Or... No, he, he's probably just... I mean, he's experienced as fuck, right? So he's probably just extremely sharp. I wouldn't put it past him to do that. <laughs> Furthering the old man's will? Well, Jing is definitely pretty goddamn smart. I'll give him that. Pretty goddamn sneaky. <laughs> Is it fucked to say that I care more about this election than the current election going on right now? <laughs> I'll say it. I don't care. Hey! All the fucking hunters! Hunter exam hunters. All right, so this is gonna be one big old reunion. Nice. I can get with that. Fam familiar faces. Kisoka. Yes. Yes. Did he change? He dyed his hair orange. <laughs> it used to be like reddish pink, right? Or from am I tripping? 95 points? Who's 95 points? Oh, this motherfucker. We know who you are. <laughs> Fucking Illumi. <clears throat> Damn, Pakistan has mad. What the fuck? That many people like Pakistan? There's one vote for Gon, I peeped that. It's probably Killua. 
再選挙が決定しました。最高責任者に選ばれた以上、開票はすべて私が。I'm forty percent fucking Protestant, dude. I guess he he's been having his political campaigns and whatnot. He seems like that kind of guy. Man, I missed Hisoka in the fucking Chimera Antarctic. Not gonna lie. But I guess there was a reason behind it. Was that kid always there in the photos? I remember this photo, but I don't remember that kid.、Hmm. I'm gonna have to look back. Maybe they were always there. So that is indeed、um, the election happening, which is honestly more interesting than the real election、um, between Biden and Trump. What a fucking catastrophe that is! But you know, I'm not gonna talk about that here. It's the wrong place to talk about that kind of stuff.、Um, okay, so I'm surprised Pakistan has damn near 40% of the votes. Of course, they need—he needs a 95% ratio. But damn, he's definitely been pulling, bro.、Um, also, I know that he's—he's obviously up to up to no good. But I would be lying if I didn't say that I kind of like his character. He's very bold. He's very politically correct. He's just a perfect example of a fucking of a faker. <laughs> he's an actor. He's—I feel like he's always acting. You know what I'm saying? With a smile on his face and just yeah, you know what I mean?、Um, so yeah. Funny, uh, Gene. Um, uh, I, I get it. I get he's a super strong hunter, triple star, quadruple star hunter. I get his nan ability is probably insane, and I get he's super sharp, and I get he's more experienced than a lot of everyone in there, and maybe deserves to be the chairman the most. But why is he not visiting Gon? Come on, dude. There is li literally no good reason, right? He can't give. He can't give us a reason, a, a, at least a good one, because he, he wants to go catch some thrills. <sighs> Fuck, man. I want to like him so bad, but honestly, this whole time I've disliked him. He's just—he's a worse father than Goku, and Goku's pretty terrible, <laughs> right? You know what I'm saying? So, um, yeah. Not sure about Jing. Hopefully, they have a redemption. You know, little episode for him, so I can finally feel good about his character. But I, I feel nothing for him. You know what I'm saying?、Um, so I don't know what the hell Illumi meant by the little brother. I don't know what that's going to be about. So I guess we're just going to wait on that. It looks like Hisoka is going to step in because he can't have Gon or Killua die because, well, he wants to fight them in the future, right? Um, and that's all he wants. That's that's Hisoka's life goal is just getting into good fights, and we saw that by why he was raiding everyone in the fucking election hall, right?、Uh, fucking 90 points, 80 points shit. So he's probably gonna go help out, which is nice. I definitely have missed him. You know, he's a、uh, he's a good character,、uh, but I I understand why. See, isn't that crazy too? The Chimera Ant Arc didn't have Hisoka, Kurapika. Leorio, some of the main characters that have been with us the whole time, yet it was still an amazing arc. Isn't that crazy? It didn't even have some of the some of the other good characters in it as well, or the Phantom Troop even. Well, that's a lie. The Phantom Troop was there for a little bit. We saw Phaeton's rising sun, right? So they were there. I lied, but still, not having Soka or Kudipiko or Leorio there, which are decent. Well, Leorio. Yeah, his character could use a bit of work, but Kurapika and and Hisoka are definitely good characters. And the fact that they weren't in the Chimera Ant Arc and it was still fire, that's also saying something. So, I'm sure the the guy Hunter X Hunter ma Maker had a reason for them not not being there, but I mean it's totally fine. I have no, I wouldn't change the Chimera Ant Arc one bit, at all, not one bit. So,、um, anyway, so Killua. Um, looks like he has found, or he knows a way. I wouldn't put it past him to not know a way. I mean, he was—he used to be a professional assassin. He's honestly been through, you know, more shit than than most people in the Shuckin' Show, just by being a, a fucking twelve-year-old professional assassin. You know what I'm saying? So, maybe he does know a way to heal Gon. Maybe he does know the Nen Healer. 
I'm sure there's got to be a Tunade. You know what I'm saying? There's got to be an ultimate healer in the show somewhere. Find him. Know him. You know what I mean? So that's 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 how we bring Gon back. We can't bring Gon back by normal means. That's for sure. He's just going to stay in a coma. He's going to stay on life support and just... <sighs> That sound is awful. I, I hated hearing that sound. Fuck, man. Fucking gone. Um, okay, what else happened? Oh, I did like how they showed, uh, you know, how the Chimera Ants ended up. And apparently Bravada, and now that we know she was Reyna, um, were actually from that village that was ransacked. And they returned home. That was beautiful. Definitely made me more... I thought the emotional stuff was over with Komugi and Meduem, but no, they made me start to feel it again. Like, fuck you. <laughs> This feels train is too long. I'm off the next stop. Um, what else happened? Uh, so we found out that Colt has actually been taking care of Chimera and version of Kite. That's insane. So I can't wait to see Kite interact um, with Killua and hopefully Gon in, in the future if Gon ever gets better. You know, that would definitely be an interaction I'm interested in seeing. Um, but I mean, now that we know that Jing is here, honestly, just go fucking visit Gon, dude. Like. Do it, man. Like, I see no negatives as to why he's not visiting Gon. It's just so stupid. You know what I mean? I'm sure he believes in Gon. I'm sure maybe that's part of the reasons that he knows that Gon won't die because, you know, fucking he's got his blood rushing through Gon's veins and Gon's a, Gon's a trooper, Gon's a soldier. True, that's all true, but still, that does not give him enough of a reason to not visit his own goddamn son in a coma. It seems, it seems just stupid in my eyes. So, I don't know. Go visit Gon, bro. Fucking asshole. <laughs> Alright, man. So that's this. It looks like the, that is the next arc. It looks, it looks like this is the final arc of how um, someone gets elected and uh, Killua's attempt to save Gon. So, uh, yeah, I'm just gonna have to wait for, see, to see what happens. And, uh, well, I wish I wish Killua the best because I definitely want to see Gon back and up and running and saying, Killua! You know what I mean? I gotta see that. So, alright, man. Um, solid episodes. If you guys, uh, I mean, if you guys, I want to make a, see, I want to vote, but I don't know enough about all of the fucking, uh, Zodiacs, you know? And so far from what I know of Ging, I'm, I'm Jing, I'm not voting for him. Um, and I don't want to vote for Potty Son either, because, I mean, he seems like a, like a shady guy, you know? So, and I don't know enough about the 10 other, because there's, there's, there's 12 zodiacs, right? I don't know enough about the, about the 10 other ones to make a decision. So I gotta I gotta see see more about their personalities, see maybe their net abilities. You know what I'm saying? See if they're capable of being the chairman. Because we know the chairman was definitely capable of being the chairman. He was super strong. He was super calm. Knew how to handle situations. So I gotta see more of them to be able to make a decision. But um, yeah, man. All right. Like and subscribe. I'm out this bitch. Peace out.